niggas be tagging me like I'm in the battle. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I I be finding that hilarious. Like I'm not even in the battle. Nigga like, be getting yo, mad at did me. you see this? Yeah, they yeah yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you got to say about this now. Word. And you know, in a in a battle, it's like a fight. You could be winning one round and then the next round lose that round. Yeah, that's a fact. We didn't put money up at the beginning of the yeah, battle. Yeah, our our goal is just to call it honestly. Yeah, she was at the house with me yeah. for of a day when when shit was dropping back to back to back. Me and she was in there like. Yo, shit getting a little wild, man. Shit was, yeah, getting, it was crazy. getting crazy. It was getting crazy, man. It was a good weekend, though. Besides that, my show got canceled. Nigga said it was a windstorm. I'm mad about that because I would have went to the Kentucky. I was invited to the Kentucky Derby, but I couldn't go to the Kentucky Derby because I had a show, and the show got canceled, so I missed Kentucky Derby. Shout out to UTA and getting us the tickets and everything. Um, I really wish I would have went. That's like, and I ain't going to say it's bucket list shit, but it's shit that I've never been to that I want to be like, yeah, I did that mm-hmm. already. Man, I missed that. Yeah, that would have been super dope. And so then, who you think won? The battle? Yeah. Right now, man, I'm going to be honest. Kendrick, I don't like what Drake dropped last night because it wasn't bad, but I don't like the way it ended. He seemed like he like, this the last one I'm doing. Like, you can't end it when you just want to end it. You know, he like, yeah. yo, he like, yo, man, it's all, I'm tired of doing this, this, that, and the third. And I just think that you shouldn't have did, ended it like that. You just got to keep going. That's yeah. just my opinion right now. I'm not saying Drake ain't my bro or nothing, but I don't like the way he ended it, if that's the end for him, my, me personally. So I'm going to go with Kendrick right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm going with Kendrick as well. It seemed like whatever whatever he started out doing, he, he picked up the speed pause and really did what he was supposed to do. I thought the record that he did, the last one that he did was the one I thought he should have done a little bit earlier, but you know, meet the Grams or the other it. one. The meet the Grams, I, I you know, I would have started with meet the Grams, and then I would have went into, you know, not like that. Oh, what's the name of the record? Exact name. Not Speaking like of, us. Not, not like, like us. us. Yeah, that was crazy. When I heard that, I was like, oh yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be tough. Hey, yo, Larry. So you just walked in with a girl, please. This ain't the motherfucking hangout. <laughs> who just came in yo oh craze my bad craze my fault <laughs> all right well, we good yeah so when he dropped the second record the um the the last record not second that um not like us that was the one i was expecting yeah look that back to back was good. the meet the grams i thought it was good but i just thought the one Drake dropped before that. See, what happened was this. Then we went out. Yeah. What was um, Drake one before that? Before, push-ups? No, not after push-ups. Family Matters? They played that in the clubs. Mm. And the, and Meet the Grams, you couldn't really play in the club. So when niggas went out that night, they played Family Matters like 10 times back to back in the club. So when Kendrick came with an upbeat one, they played that in the club yeah. like 10 times in a row. And the one Drake just dropped, it was kind of slow. It seemed like he don't want to do it no more pause. And I just don't like the way it ended. But like you said, murder, we'll see. To be continued. But it don't <laughs> yeah. seem like Drake won a battle no more. I still. So Cameron and Mace a few days ago were telling Kendrick that Euphoria is 616 in LA was just not enough. Get to it, get to it. And now that he's gotten to it, they're saying that that's enough. We're good. You won. Good job, buddy. And while I did see some pictures of Cameron and Mace in like some OVO New York Nick type varsity jackets, you know, so that told me they were compromised there. And then I did realized that Drake had brought Dipset out during his show at one point. I was like, oh yeah, Cameron's definitely, you can even hear it in how he's talking now. He's like, I hate it had to end this way. Oh yeah, he's definitely like on Drake's side in this whole thing. And he's just like, sounds disappointed at this point. Like, damn, Mace is just like, I wanted Kendrick to drop Not Like Us five days ago, <laughs> but it is what it is. I'll take it now, he won. And yeah, that's just the truth of the matter. Kendrick Lamar won this beef, he won it. 
I had him winning after Meet the Grams because while the daughter thing might not be true, if I am to assume and speculate and ask myself, Michael, do you think Drake has illegitimate kids? And then the picture of the CLB cover pops up in my head. I go, yes, yeah, yeah. He, he might have some kids out there that he doesn't know about. So it's not it's not bad for Kendrick to bring that point up during that song. I, I thought it was brilliant. It's a nightmare fucking song. Meet the Grams is a nightmare. Anyways, let me know what you think about Cameron and May saying Kendrick Lamar is the winner in the comments below. I am Savvy Mike and this has been a long fuck arc. Hopefully we're at the end of it. Anyways, peace.